Immunohistochemistry is often used to examine protein expression in tissue samples and is evaluated in a microscope. This traditional way of protein examination has several methodological issues such as choice of area or method of scoring. In addition, subjective evaluation of the tissue might lead to intra and inter-observer variation. And of course, it's very time consuming. Here at the Institute, we have developed Immunopath, which is a digital tool using whole slide image scans for analyzing immune stained tissue sections, both for clinical and research purposes. The benefits of Immunopath is that it brings a solution to all the challenges one faces when doing this microscopical evaluation of the section. It's uh, automated, objective and efficient. The first thing you want to do after you have opened your Immunopath program is to make a protocol. So what we usually do is that we have a collection of tiles representative for the tissue and also the expression of the protein. Uh, once you have that, you can set up a protocol. And the way that is done is by defining the color range for both the positive and the negative objects. Pre and post processor commands can also uh, be utilized for optimization of the protocol. But we are not going to do that now. We are satisfied. So we just save this uh, protocol as a illustration. I have another one we are going to use when we do the analysis. So what we want to do now is to upload our case and we are looking at a colorectal tissue section and we want to investigate the expression of CD8. And we need to mark the tumor area. And that is easily done just by going through. And what we want to do is to avoid uh, large areas of intermixed benign glands and also artifacts. Once we are finished marking the tumor area, we want to tile it. Do that by pressing tiles. And then we want to sample our tiles. And what you see now is that each tile is uploaded into this gallery. And for this case with a large, fairly large tumor area, it takes some, some minutes. Once all the tiles are sampled, we are ready to run analysis. What we see now is that it goes through every tile with the protocol we have chosen and scoring every tile uh, for positive and negative cells, which are represented by the red and green dots you are seeing. Once every tile has been scored, it produces a table under results where you can see the score for each tile. But if you scroll to the bottom, you also have a summary for the whole sample. And for our case, you can see that 8% of the epithelial cells for this tumor are expressing the CD8 protein. You can also easily export the results for further statistical analysis.